What's up, Fish Tank TV? This is Boy with a Fish Tank, and um, today we are basically gonna talk about these plants I put in uh, with the African seedlets. Now, I put them in yesterday from the planted tank. Um, if you saw my extreme plant growth video, you probably have seen these plants growing like really, really crazy. I got some really, really good cuttings from this. Um, let me just find the name for you. I got it here on the on the PC. Limnophila Phila Sicily Flora. Um, maybe I'm butchering the name right there, but I'm gonna put the name right here uh, for you guys. But um, it's a really really cool plant. Um, will grow up to thirty centimeters, um, which is quite big, you know, and. Um, I'm actually just giving them iron and they're just growing like really 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 well um, but I guess the problem with this is um, if you have if you don't have a lot of lighting in your tank it's not gonna grow very well it actually requires pretty good lighting um, but I've heard of, I've heard of some people um, who actually have done it um, without much lighting and special lighting and stuff like that but just uh, got away with CO2. Um, I also found some on Tropica that did that. Um, but uh, anyways, it's a really cool plant, and uh, I actually thought when I put them in that the African cichlids would completely destroy it. But I thought, um, you know, no mind because I just had to put them in uh, and see what happens. Because uh, if I didn't put them in, I would just throw them out. Um, so I could just try it. Um, to see what happens, um, but uh, my my where is he? My compressor seps absolutely love these plants. He is actually sitting down there. You just see that <laughs> he just loves that. Sometimes he come out and swim, uh, but at the moment he actually feels real real safe down here. Uh, but he mostly comes when I'm feeding, because um, he's actually eating quite a lot. But uh, the reason he's staying in there is. Uh, also from his nature, that uh, in the wild, uh, you know, compressor surfs are actually hiding in plants and waiting for uh, fish to come by to eat. Um, but my peacock, my German Red, <laughs> is just a bastard. I'm just saying, he's just annoying. And uh, he's chasing him. He's, he's not biting him or anything, he's just chasing him. Swimming after him constantly, which is really, really stupid. And I don't know why he does it, but uh, that is what he really, really loved that. Uh, and he does that to him and chase him back there in the plants but it seems like a good home to him that was also a reason I put him in there um, but also my Kenyai now I just got a male Kenyai for my female Kenyais I got two female Kenyais I, you can see one of them right there um, and I actually think they're starting to breed and uh, if uh, they are beginning to breed, the female probably have to rest a little bit and uh, be put into the plants. And the fry can also hide in there, and so I'm uh, gonna catch them and put them in uh, uh, another aquarium to make them grow. Um, anyhow, my um, my synodontists actually also just love these plants um, because they are just growing down to the roots, and they're probably gonna tear them apart, not tear them apart like that, but they're gonna make them float to the top um, which is quite annoying, but they do that um, but that doesn't matter because it's not ruining the plants um, because it's actually a plant that takes uh, nutrients from uh, the water column and uh, now I just read that it comes from Southeast Asia um, a really really cool tropical plant um, and also, my Melanochromis aurotis fish. Now you can see, is this the biggest one? I can't remember, but I got two of these. Um, they were both females. I thought of getting a male at some time. But um, they actually also really like those plants over there. They like to swim inside them and uh, just chill. So, um, I think it looks pretty good. And uh, I know that there's a lot of people who wanted to know how to get a planted African cichlid tank and um, I have a lot of experience with planted tanks and cichlids 
so you know I can actually tell you how to do this and that is why I did this um, it also looks just gorgeous so um, in another video in a tutorial Tuesday maybe I can tell you how to actually keep um, plants with African cichlids without making them go completely crazy on them um, and I guess that is it um, so yeah see you guys in another video